Good morning. I was wondering when you were gonna get all that hair off of there. Thanks for the suggestion, Tim. Oh yeah, baby. That looks nice, real nice. Morning, you guys welcome back to tubes time you're logging into our daily vlog series called the daily grind and this is episode number 40 today we just got done milking the cow and we are going to be working a little bit more on some doors um, I'm actually had to do some carving overnight because this carving that I'm putting on this one door or this set of doors should I say took way longer than I thought it was going to yesterday so in order to finish on time, I'm having to carve through the night. So stick around and we'll show you how that goes. So whenever I have door orders, I stay really busy because not only do I have the venue to keep up with and the doors to work on, but I also have the cows to keep up with and the sheep to keep up with and the ducks to keep up with and find some time to eat in there and spend time with the family and anything else that decides to break and be added to my list around here has to get done good lord cry me a river so stay a little bit stressed out whenever these door orders are getting close to needing to be shipped out so if i seem a little stressed during these videos because I am <laughs> honestly if everything was you know gravy over at the venue I wouldn't be near stressed but I'm, I know that I have other things I'm having to build over there that are at the end of their rope I've been sitting outside for five years now and some you know things just start to rot if they're not under roof you know so the whole time I'm working on this other stuff, the doors mainly, I'm thinking about all the stuff I'm also having to build over there that need to be done ASAP. Look man, quit whining and just get to it. And also the stuff that 
I'm needing to get done before Callum gets here. And uh, the compilation of all these things can stress you out a little bit. It's okay though, I mean, could be worse. I could be doing all this work for a corporate company and bettering their company, but instead we're bettering our own lives. Finally, a positive note. So it has its upside. And even though sometimes I feel like I don't get to see my kid enough, I get to see him all throughout the day. Even if I'm not hanging out with him and the wife, you know, I get to see both of them rolling around here on the mule and the tractor. I get to see both of them at lunch. Get to put him down for a nap sometimes. All of which I would have not been able to do if I was still working offshore. I would have gotten to see them only half of the year at a time, which is crazy to think about. So glad I don't do that job anymore. Just gonna do a little bit of milk straining and, and head back over to the house and get some breakfast. And then jump right back on working on the doors. I think two gallons plus will start being her norm again. Now that the weather's cooled back off, thank God. Cause for a while it was like, sometimes we'd be getting a gallon, sometimes a gallon and a half if she was doing really good. But some of that was our fault being, we had this period of time where I had to skip milking her a lot. <laughs> Seemed like every three days four days or so for a couple weeks i was not milking her but it was mainly due to the summer heat i believe because her cream line's getting better again too You're doing what? You're playing? Um, a little more specificity would be nice. You're dumping dirt out of the trailer? Oh, wow. It's got a little, it's got a gate on it. I didn't know that. Whoa. Yay. Get some more scoops. Get some more scoops. He likes you the You gotta scoops. count your scoops. That is just adorable.
Well, I'm still doing some cutting. I'm on my last cut. Got all the doors as far as I can go until I glue this last panel on and let this glue dry overnight. And tomorrow I'll be able to do some finish work on them. But in between cuts, just been doing a lot of rock work that I've been meaning to do for a while. Obviously I need to come back and re-backfill with some more mulch in this area. Originally had a bunch of mulch, <clears throat> but because I didn't have the rocks up there yet, after a few years of being there, you know, dirt and mulch gets washed away. I still have just enough dirt though, if I could just get some more mulch in there to keep the rest of it from washing out, it'll be good. Also at the same time, I'm continuing to line my driveway with the big rocks. This is gonna be an opening that allows me, if I have to, for whatever reason, to drive across the yard on occasion with a trailer or something like that. Um, but the outside row of rocks is gonna continue all the way around. Everywhere you see timbers, those timbers are gonna be removed and rocks are gonna be in their place all the way till it reaches those rocks over there. And then the ultimate goal, I mean, this isn't anything I'm planning to do right now, just as I have time to get rocks, you know, I wanna line this entire driveway with them. Kind of just an ongoing thing. I always do a little bit of work on this whenever I have the time. Hey. Let's see if they'll actually jump out of there on their own. I haven't let them do this yet. <laughs> there they go. Hey, duckies. No, no, right. They look tasty, don't they, Ryder? <laughs> Looks like I'm their mama now. Y'all wanna look over here, see if we can find any critters? Oh, I bet there's critters over here. Yeah, come here. I bet we can find one. Critters love mulch. Maybe let's look under a rock. 
Uh. Oh, here's a critter. There you go. Here. You got it. Good job. I learn somehow, don't they? Get it, get it, get it, get it. Good job. There it is. Got it. Got a little grasshopper. Who wants it? Oh, good job. That was good, huh? Yeah. You just gotta move these rocks to get it, that's all. They'll eat ants, probably not. Ants will probably eat them, they're so little. Got another cricket. There you go. Oh, is that good? That's good, huh? Oh, you got anything else? These little ducklings are getting bigger and bigger every day. Literally, they look completely different when you wake up. It's insane. I'm gonna go look for some more. Come here. Okay, this one's got like a piece of paper. <laughs> don't eat that. You don't wanna eat that, I promise. <laughs> All right, let's look under the rocks. <laughs> There's one. There's a critter. Get it. Look. Get it. Good job. Nope, nothing but ants under that rock. <laughs> Ooh, here's one. I've got a really massive following. Good Lord, you are so corny, man. <laughs> but that was kind of funny. There's just something fun about this, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Come on, quack quacks. <laughs> My grandfather would have loved this. He was a huge bird enthusiast. Oh, there we go. He had all sorts of different kind of birds growing up. Another one, come here, look. 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 There you go. Good job. Look, here's some critters. There you go. Look. Look. Look, look. 
They're in there. There. Huh. I'm just showing you where they are. You can't rely on me to hand feed them all to you. Uh. Oh, ants. Lots of ants. Termites. Do y'all eat termites? That would be awesome. Look. 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 Look at these little critters. Get them. Get them. Get those. Look. Get those. Will you eat those? They said we really like this weed here. Ooh, look at all those. Y'all better get out. Y'all better get out of here. Come on. Come on. That was a good bit of training. <laughs> yeah, I'd love for those ducks to not be scared of me at all. Just would make rounding them up at the end of the night easier, you know? Not sure exactly how that's gonna go just yet. But the more human friendly I can make them. It's gotta just make my life easier, right? Where are we going? To, to, to your dirt pile. Uh -huh. Sure do got a lot of rocks now, huh? So there with this. Okay. What can I play with? Like this. this one? Okay. Okay. Got some. My buddy Seth graciously came over to help me load up this massive door so that we could bring it over to uh, the customer's house, which was on the same route that we take to get to church for worship practice. So I could not have done this without his help. This thing was so heavy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Where's he going, Asher? To church. to church practice. Is he gonna deliver that big door? Uh -huh. Yeah. Dump it. That's dirty water. You gonna dump it for me? All right. You ready to fill it up with some clean water? Who are we getting this water for? Who's this water for, Asher? For who? 
Maple. For maple? Mm -hmm. That's right. What are we gonna go check the mailbox for? <laughs> for okay, you have, a, you have a mouthful of food, Letter. huh? Letters, huh? I hear. For your bathtub. I hear. I hope so, we gotta go check. Gotta get Maple her water first, huh? Oh, you're such a big helper. Okay, I think that's enough. What are we gonna go check the mail for? The letters. What are you gonna do with those letters? It's on the bathtub. In the bathtub, and you're gonna spell words. Uh huh. <gasps> Yay! Hey, did we put up the cows? Oh, that's medicine. I want it. I should. Hey, did we put up the cows? Uh -huh. We did. Now what are we doing? Mm -hmm. Are we checking on the sheep? Mm -hmm. Checking. Look at those sheep. Daddy already get from the mail lady. What came in? The letters. What is this? Oh my goodness! They came in. They came in. I'll play with you. You wanna play with them in the bathtub? Yay! What are you gonna spell? You see the numbers? It says one, two, three. Yay, your letters! They <coughs> did. Where's the B? Right here. Yeah, that, okay. Okay, Asher, where, spell your name for me. Do you see it up there? A S H E R, Asher. Asher, do you love your letters? F. F. That's an F. What's the F sound? F. 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 Funny. Funny. <laughs> yeah. Funny. Funny, honey. Funny, funny. Oh, can you find me a B? A ba 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 B? For baby? Yeah, for baby. There it is. Daddy. Can you find the D for daddy? Da, 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 daddy? Where's it at? It's hiding from you. There it is. Good job. Yay, your letters. <laughs> Yay! Well, guys, I'm back home from worship practice, coming to get these duckies <laughs> and riders outside, just sitting right around their pen. Still haven't figured out if he is protecting them or just hoping one escapes so that he can have a snack. I don't really know, but. Uh, <laughs> He's cracking me up. Can't really see it. It's pitch black out here. But anyways, that is the end of today's episode. If you like this video, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Share it with all your friends. Hit the like button and notification bell. And we will see you on the next one. God bless y'all.